Hello guys, let's play another video, and in today's video we're going to do what if Iran made an empire. First, what we are going to do is go to war with Iraq. They declare war, and they begin pushing across the entire front line, so that they can uh, quickly cut off their access to the ocean, as well as cutting off their access or their border to Turkey and also taking over a bit of their northern regions as well. After that they begin pushing down uh, uh, the, across the, 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 their border here, I forgot their name, Ku Kuwait. Then they begin taking over more of southern uh, Iraq while continuing to push in along the entire front line to take over and after a little bit of pushing they have successfully taken over Baghdad their capital so Iraq decides to surrender Iran fully annexes Iraq and prepares to get into their next war. They are going to be fighting on multiple fronts. So they decide to go to war with Kuwait, Syria, Lebanon, Jordan, Cyprus, which gets Turkey involved, as well as Afghanistan joining in for some reason. The first thing they do is push down and uh, conquer all of Kuwait and they then begin pushing in to Syria over here and as, as well as Jordan then they also use the army they had stationed at the Afghan border to begin pushing in a little just so that uh, they can have enough time to evacuate their citizens in case of in case something happens. They push about this far in before they begin pushing in uh, in uh, to Turkey as well. So then they begin trying to spearhead through uh, Syria to get to the coast after they m have made it to the coast they conquer or occupy Lebanon as well as take over the Syrian coast and uh, try to uh, make their way up to take or to eliminate Turkish naval bases in the Mediterranean begin uh, pushing in taking over southern Syria and also pushing uh, and taking over Jordan after they have done that they begin pushing up uh, take over the occupy the rest of Syria and after they successfully managed to do that they decide to focus their attention on Afghanistan. They begin pushing in to uh, trying their or uh, trying their best to take over the nation. And after a little while, they try to they ask for a peace treaty, but Iran refuses because they want to take over all of Afghanistan just to see what's going just to see uh, what's going to happen to them because they are known as the graveyard of empires and after a little while longer they have s nearly completely cut off Afghanistan from the entirety of the outside world everything except from airports airports are now the only way to 
or you can only leave Afghanistan by plane now. They continue pushing in, trying to uh, get them to surrender as fast as possible so they can uh, focus their attention on Turkey and Cyprus. And after a while, after they have seen how completely hopeless the situation is, they decide to surrender. Then, Iran begins pushing in to Turkey, who's not managed to prepare all that much over in the easternmost part of their country. So, and uh, after they made it about this far, they began getting stopped. They decided to just begin pushing as hard as they can to try to at least get an encirclement, which they managed to do. They then begin closing in on this encirclement of theirs until they have completely occupied the, that entire area and eliminated all enemy troops. They then land in Cyprus and completely occupy both northern and so southern Cyprus. And then begin pushing, planning to push up through here. And after a little while, they managed to get a breakthrough, surround the troops that were stationed here, and begin uh, pushing, uh, in, pushing further along the coast, thinking that they should probably try to take as much land as they possibly can now that they have the chance. So after they made it here, they get stopped and simply just begin uh, pushing uh, across the entire border randomly. And they certainly made a huge breakthrough here. And making it so that they're able to push quite far along the coast until they get stopped around here with Turkey trying to stop them from taking over Istanbul but while they're doing that they weren't able to stop them from taking over their capital of Anarka so now with their great amount of momentum their army has they break through their front lines and take over Istanbul as well as the rest of Turkey after that they decide to take this much of Afghanistan uh, this much of Turkey and also the rest of all the other countries. What they do there is puppet Turkey and Afghanistan and they take the rest of the land that they wanted to have for themselves and after they have managed to do just that What's going to happen next? After that is that they will be satisfied with their empire and simply this is the new Persian Empire so I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.